Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. When you erase a file from your hard drive, are you really erasing it? Well, not really. If you're not using a, an erase utility, you may just be deleting a file. Erase, delete, well, what's the difference? Well, deleting a file is, let's say in Windows, you would take an object like a document and drag it into the recycle bin and then empty the recycle bin and you will have deleted the file. The operating system wouldn't know where to find it anymore but utilities could be downloaded from the internet to be able to recover that deleted file, an undelete utility. Erasing, on the other hand, is eliminating all traces of that file so that there's no way you could undelete the file. A user came into the chat room the other day at live.perillo.com and asked us for some good software to securely delete files in unused space. So he wants to erase the files from existence. So when you've got a, a file on your hard drive, and it was once located, let's say, here. If you delete it, the operating system doesn't know where to find it. But if you erase it, essentially, you're taking, uh, let's say, utility or just uh, you know, another file on, that you have on your computer overwrites the place on that hard drive where that original file was sitting. And by doing that, you're essentially making it that, so that that file that was deleted could never be recovered. A utility to use for erasing files and data from your hard drive, or I guess any drive for that matter, is a utility called Eraser. It can be available to you by searching Google. You just look for the word Eraser, and at least for me, it was the first result. It's free, and it uses a variety of methods to erase data from your hard drive, including the same methods that the Department of Defense uses to erase data. Now you would do this if you had something on your hard drive you didn't want anybody else to know about, or let's say you were storing passwords or information that was you know, relatively, well, you wanted to keep secure. Uh, if you use something like this, you are essentially minimizing the chances of that data ever being recovered. This is a free utility. Again, uh, it does do whole hard drive erasing using Derek's boot and nuke method, which is a, another utility available. It's actually open source. Um, erases the index dat, which is the file that Internet Explorer uses to cache information uh, from your browser. It uh, erases compressed files and drives, network files, cookies, paging or swap files, uh, anything you can think of sitting on your hard disks, it will erase. So, Chris, yes, hello, hi live guest. <laughs> um, I hate Vista, it keeps freezing with a webcam connected to it. Yeah, well that's the problem with Vista. I don't know if this utility will work with Vista. It says it'll work through Windows Server 2003, so I'd assume that this, this one, Eraser, is its name. Very creative name, but that's exactly what it does. Um, if you haven't thought about erasing the files that you once thought you had deleted or that you had deleted, think twice. Uh, they're still possibly on your hard disk. Someone could extract them at some point in the future. Cover your tracks, especially if that computer is not in your control or if you plan on that computer not being in your control at some point in the future.